Hello ladies and gentlemen, Marauder EX here, back with more Let's Play Jean d'Arc. Alright, so two new places opened up. Uh, the Bogs are from Mond, and the Coliseum. We're gonna go to the Coliseum, and we're just gonna kinda kill some time. This is gonna be something just, you know, to, to goof off with. Uh, because there is no way we can actually beat it at this point. We just lack everything. But I wanna show it off, so we're gonna do that. The Coliseum! And we have a familiar face, uh, Robert, he was the head of the militia that originally, uh, kinda gave Jean crap, but he's just kinda dancing around here, he is the MC for the Coliseum. It's time to play, say it with me now, yield or no yield. You know, like deal or no deal, that's, that's the joke. Uh, uh dated references. I'm your host, Bobby D <laughs> Baudicourt. Uh, that's, yeah, he's, it's funny, it's funny. Uh, contestants, the rules of the game are simple. For ten rounds, we will put you against bloodthirsty opponents. Yield, and you can walk away from any match unscathed. But if you don't yield, and you survive all ten pommel-greasing rounds, you will win a fabulous prize. Lose a match, and that's it. It's g, -g, -g game over. Combo breaker. You have to start over again the next time you enter. Alright, you've been given the facts. Your decision, please. I like how he he's, he's he dances around. He is... It's like he's a member of uh, the Ginyu Force. It's great. Alright, so, we can yield and return to the map, or no yield, which is kind of strange considering we haven't fought yet. So technically it's not yielding. It's starting. Let's toss you right into round one. Get ready, get set, go! Alright, so, Coliseum, defeat all enemies, all allies fall in battle. Those are the only rules. So, anything else that we've done comes into play. So, armlet wielders can transform once they build up enough SP. Uh, spells work, uh, coup de grace skills work, everything works just as it would in a normal fight. As far as I can tell, there are no hidden treasures on the Coliseum map. Um, I could be wrong about that. I have not found any... Like there's there's nothing in the guide about it, so I don't I don't know. So um, just like any any match, you can uh, you know customize your equipment, create new skills, equip them. The downside is when you get into the arena, it is a two versus however many they throw at you. At least for the first couple of rounds. I don't know if that increases because I've not made it past the first couple of rounds. Because it gets exponentially harder. But we get to pick where we put our people. We can start off in any of these places. So we have four groups of nine where we can put our people. So, you know, depending on what you want to do, you can spread them out. You know, kind of pincer them in or have both people start off in the same place, kind of go from there. That's kind of what I'm going to do. So uh, I'm going to throw in uh, Kalei because uh, you do get XP here. So he needs XP, we're going we're gonna to kind of give that to him. And then uh, Leanne is, is kind of our default for Jean at the moment. Alright, so walk over. Let's see, let's... Let's attack. And, yeah. It's... It, it... This is it. So... Do a little bit of damage. 92. But a miss. So... Enemy turn. And, as you can see, we have 20 turns for this. So, depending on how things have to play out, you could very easily just, uh, just kite everything around the, uh, the battlefield, which is actually not a bad strategy for the first couple of matches, because there's, it's really hard to deal with some of the stuff. So, let's see. Kill him. And we'll let, uh, Kole get the kill, so that he gets the XP from it. I don't know how XP values are generated here, but... 
let's see, 31 XP for killing an orc. That's, it's a little off to me, and that, that could just be me, but that's, that's a little off. But Kole being the weakest link, everyone wants a piece of Kole. So, that's, that's how that's... But he could just kill this one on his own, because I'm pretty sure I could do more than 45 points of damage. And there we go. That's the first round. So you're like, oh, that's that's simple. It it gets exponentially harder. It's like, oh, well, you could handle three orcs that are just orcs, have HP values, but still do a fair bit of damage. Like if I if I were to go back and find some of the orcs that we were going against, they would not be doing that much damage to us. They would be doing considerably less. So the Colosseum seems to have its own unique versions of enemies uh, to be slightly more level appropriate. Uh, oh, are you ready for more bone-crunching action, or will you retire now with your appendages, appendages still intact? It's your decision! And I, I, the pose, I just, I keep seeing a raccoon from him. Alright, grab your braze, then it's time for round two! Get ready, get set, go! So yeah, this is, this is it. This is the... We've got four enemies now. And what we're going to do is we're going to do the same thing we just did. Um, we're going to have... Same two people. Again, mostly for XP purposes. But that's this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to go through like the first couple of rounds of the uh the the Colosseum in order to uh to gain some uh gain some much needed XP for some of my people. The money is not great, but everything else is is all right. All right. So, let's see. What is your attack range? So you could attack her. So we're just going to move here. What is your attack range? Okay. Alright, so we need to... For this one, it, it's basically... Let's let's get them to come close. Again, I'm just going to try to kite them around the, the battlefield. The best that I can. And I'm, I'm not expecting to win, uh, honestly. I, I won... I've, I've gone through the first two fights here before, and like this fight, we're going against regular two regular orcs, two orc knights, and an orc king. Like, attack of 209, 197, 185, versus 159. <laughs> so that'll tell you about where we're at in terms of, of of this. Let's see. Can I hit anyone with a thunderbolt from here? No, I can't. So, I gotta move there. Skills, thunderbolt. And that's, that's what we're gonna do. We're just gonna hit them from a distance. They're going to uh, come up and try to be obnoxious. And, and get in our face, but we're going to just kind of peel them off one at a time, except this is what they're going to do. They're, they really don't like Kole. So Woodchop is going to be their primary. And it hurts. Woodchop hurts. It hurts bad. <laughs> so... And they all have it. And apparently their accuracy with it is actually pretty impressive. So, now what we need to do is just kind of have, have uh, Leanne be a, uh, a shield, and she's just going to kind of, like, try to block off the others from Kole, and that's really it, except him being in the way makes that uh, so much more obnoxious. So we're just gonna, like I said, we're just gonna wander around. You're going to attack. Miss, thankfully. 
kill him with a critical, and that's that's it. Just keep it so that only one can try to attack at a time, and uh, go from there. Except I I I'm misjudged, so that's going to be great. So wood chop miss and 26 points of damage that gives you an idea of just what we're going to be doing against you know something a little bit closer to our actual level so that's that's not going to be fun all right let's just get the hell out of here so because we've got plenty of time we've got you know 16 more turns and really, a lot of what we're going to be doing is on their their turn themselves. It's like we're we're not going to be doing much. Like that's yeah, counterattacks are are it. Counterattacks and healing. We take our turn to heal. We use their turn to counterattack. Oh, they hit me. That's not always a good thing. Because I, I really don't want to have to buy healing items, but I'm probably going to. So, that's that's just going to be wonderful. I'm looking forward to that. Alright. And move, and heal. And move Kalei. And probably heal Kalei again. Except Kalei does not have a heal ability. No, Kalei's fine. So, we'll move him there. And, yeah, we just use the pillars to help kind of funnel them. Like that. But yeah, wood chop. That's the... That's their thing. That is their obnoxious thing. And Leanna's 33, so Mazel Tov. And yeah, this is what it's supposed to be, except that one's not going to play by the rules. He's going to try to sneak around. So... That's fine. That's fine. Let's see. Let's go ahead and move you here. No, you're gonna heal. You're gonna heal yourself. And we're just gonna keep running around and circle. This is not the most, you know, impressive fight, but uh, it's 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 a strategy nonetheless. So. And that's, that's, that's the problem. It's like, I, I shouldn't have tried to come into the, the, the Colosseum now. But I really did want to show this off, because I didn't show off the other battlefield with the, uh, the, the high-end monsters, because there's no way I can beat that one. This one I can at least get through a little bit of the Colosseum. And, oh, they are getting really, really good with their attacks. Where, which one was the, uh... Oh, he... Okay, I was like... When they gray out, it's really hard to tell who's who. So... Um... I could probably start to go on the offensive now, but I'm not going to. I'm gonna... I'm gonna wait one more round. Because, uh... To go on the offensive, what I would need to do is just transform and have her kill everyone. Which, you know, as entertaining as that is, it's it's also a little boring. Not that this isn't boring, really, because I mean, it's it's basically like he's dead. We've we've killed him because he's gonna count. Well, then we'll counter, and we guard that one, and he's dead because he only had eight HP. So. And you're still... You're a little close to me. I don't like how close you are. And you're dead, because... She'll counter. And... Yeah, I need. I do need to get Kalei to level up. I don't think he's going to in this one. But this is what I'm going to do off-screen for a bit. To get people up to level. Oh, he did, he's level 30. Okay. 
Alright, so what we're gonna do is... We'll go ahead and transform and take these guys out. Because at this point, this is, this is done. This is done. We've got two left, we've got our transformation. Let's see, how much damage can we do to the king? Scarlet Soil will do 166. So that's not enough to kill him. But, hopefully, that will... That's not going to get him low enough for Kalei to kill him. Because I don't think Kalei is going to do 34 points of damage to him. Nope. Nope, nope, nope. Mm, but, and look, 94 points of damage if he successfully hits me on the counter. He has a 6% chance, so that would have had to have been an incredibly unlucky roll to do that. But he's gonna try! Because <laughs> he's got wood chop. Uh, swing and a miss, and. Counter attack for the kill. Wood chop and HP plus 30. Okay. I'm kind of okay with that. And they're gonna, again, try to go after Kalei. Which, you know. At this point, I can just have Kalei kill them, so. In fact, I might, because I'm pretty sure I could do 32 points of damage to him. Let's see. Yeah. So he's dead. So that is round two. Uh, I'm not going to do round three, but I will show you round three. Um, because I know we're going to lose, so we don't get any bonus XP, but we do get bonus gold. I, I don't like the not getting bonus XP, because... Uh, but I can see how that would be a thing. Like, you could just go into this fight over and 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 over again, and just level up people who aren't in the fight. But, I mean, you could do that with any other fight. I guess th this one's just f faster. Alright, so, um, one thing I'm going to do is I'm going to, uh, I don't do this on screen often, but I'm going to, uh, save state... So we can do this, uh, because I, like I said, I want to show this off by just continuing, but then I'm going to load the state and then no yield just so that I don't have to, uh, you know, lose the fight in order to leave. Grab your escargot, and then it's time for round three. Get ready, get set to go. So last round was orcs. This round is some of the orcs that we've already been dealing with, and then lizardmen. <laughs> So we've got Lizard Guardians, we've got two Orc Kings this time, two, uh, two Lizard uh, Guardians, two Orc Kings, and a Lizard Marshal. 205 attack, plus he's ranged. And then they've got, you know, they've got a lot of stuff. <laughs> Luna Spirit plus two, Take Flight, Piercing Power two, Revenge, Accuracy plus ten, what do you have? Soul Spirit plus two, Wood Chop, Attack plus five, HP thirty. So, like, these guys are, you know, decently, you know, uh, paced for us. Everyone else, not so much so. Uh, so, like I said, I, I don't expect to win this one, but I'm going to be uh, kind of a douche. <laughs> and we're going to just uh, do this one long range for just a couple of minutes until we, we run out of time. Um, so, yeah. Let's just move you there, attack, and... Yeah. And that that's that's it. I can't really do much of anything with him, because he has no MP. That's the downside about MP. I love that the MP management in this game is really taken care of for you, so that way, you know, it, you can just take a turn to recover a little bit of, of MP. Ow. That's... okay. I forgot, they are ranged. Well, slightly ranged. So, yeah, that's not gonna work. He's... Let's just come over here, attack. Because I would need to heal myself now. Actually, I could, uh... Oh, really? Yeah, I'd have to... That's, that's derp. That's derp. 
Oh, I was hoping that I had a, a strategy for this, but no, 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 I just... Mostly it's kind of hard to, to develop a strategy when, like, oh yes, I... Two against five. And... Impale is a thing. That's, that's gonna make this a much harder to, to do type of strategy. But if, like, you know, level them up a little bit more, get a couple more, you know, really big AoEs. Like, 59 points of damage. That's really not a lot. So, yeah, that's, that's what we, we get to do here. So, uh, I'm gonna be doing a lot of, of grinding off-screen for the, uh, the Colosseum to deal with that. So, uh, uh, I'm, I'm not expecting, you know, this to go particularly well, but, uh, it's, it's interesting. It's, it's different. So, um, yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and end this episode here, and I will see you guys in the next installment, where I will continue on with the story. So, uh, till then, later everyone.